In January 2024, I made more than $7,000 with this product. It's not my first time doing it as I've been able to scale multiple stores to six figures. In this video, I'm going to take you by the hand and I'm going to show you exactly how I did it step by step so you can do the same. I'm going to show you how I built my store and I'm going to include a little secret in there because I think because of this secret, I've been able to generate this amount of sales. I'm going to show you how I advertise this product and what platform that I advertise it on. Just a side note, for this specific product, I tried a lot of platforms but none of them actually worked and only one of them actually brought me these results. I'm going to tell you what are the main tips and tricks that got me here. And most importantly, I'm not just going to give you a fish and feed you for a day. I'm going to teach you how to fish, meaning that I'm going to show you exactly how I found this product so you can do the same. All right, guys. So first things first, we need a store, right? We cannot just sell our product in an open market. We need a store to sell it. For this, I streamlined this process by going the easier route. I went to autodias.com, you click on your store's name and click on add store after that. Once you do that, you have the option to pick between multiple platforms. So let's go with Shopify. It says right here, build with AI. This is going to allow you to build a store with AI in less than two minutes. So let's go with this option. We're going to have three main options to pick from. If you already have a Shopify store, if you want a new one, or if you want an AI pre-built Shopify store. So let's go with this one, click continue. And this is where we're going to select our niche. It's basically the niche that our store is going to be based around. Make sure to pick one of these niches. Let's just go with the home and garden. And as you can see, it says right here, congratulations, your store has been successfully created. It took less than 10 seconds. The whole process takes less than two minutes. And let's log into our store. For that, copy the email that they just gave you, paste it here, click continue with email. And as for the password, copy this password that they gave you, paste it here, and you're gonna have access to your brand new Shopify store built by AI in less than two minutes. Now, the first thing that you're going to have to do is to renew your trial. It says right here, one day left from your trial. You're going to have to pick a plan. It's $1 for one month. So let's go with a plan. I highly encourage you to just go with the basic one. As a beginner, you don't necessarily need more than that. So select basic, put your first name, last name, credit card number, and click subscribe. You're only going to pay a dollar and you're going to have one full month of Shopify, which is an absolutely amazing deal. Here on your left side, you're going to see your dashboard. Now you're going to use this and you're going to see this a lot of time as a dropship. Cheaper. The analytics is the most important part. You're going to see what's happening with your store here. But right now, let's just look at the online store. So this is how our store looks like. Homely, and instead of the O, they just put a house in there. Pretty cute. It's exactly what you need as a beginner. You don't need more than this. It's a very simple, straight to the point, very easy to use website. And as you can see right here, we have some products. If you click on any of them, it will take you to their product page with description and high quality images and everything. If you're wondering what is this, let's go back to the Shopify store and click products. You're going to see that we have a lot of products in this area. Now, these products are coming from AutoDS, so I highly encourage you to check them out. And I highly encourage you to also import more products from AutoDS. Now, these winning products are winning right now as we speak. Winning products always come in a wave. They are always other products that are making waves on the markets. So you got to watch the market at all times. Yes, these products that you just got from AutoDS automatically imported to your store. They are a very good addition to a brand new store. But maybe, let's say, two months from now, one month from now, these products are not going to be trending anymore. So you're going to have to find new products to put in here. That's why you need to have an AutoDS account and to link it with your store so that you're going to have access to new winning products every single day. Now, after like 20 minutes of work, the website looks like this. Now, it is blurred. I know it's blurred. I don't want to show you the whole website because I want to show you step by step exactly what I did. I don't want to spoil the surprise. And so, guys, here comes the first step of this video. The website doesn't really matter. People don't just go to see your homepage. People want to see your product page. So what is the product page? The product page is the page which people are going to visit after they are going to click your ads. So the first step would be for them to see your ad. They like the ad. They say, hmm, I want to buy this product. Let me check it out. And they're going to click your ad. Once they click your ad, they are going to be taken to your product page. Very important. They are not going to be taken to the homepage. So nobody will try to see your website. They don't care about that. They will just care about the product that they saw on your ad and they click on. That is why the product page is the most important page that you can have on your store because that's where the traffic goes. All right, so the website that I just built here was looking pretty nice. The logo was nice. Everything was okay, but it felt kind of lonely, right? It needed some products. And this is where the second step of this video comes to place. And that is finding a winning product. So what is a winning product then? A winning product is a product that's very, very hot on the market. Everybody wants to buy that product. And if you're a seller and you know how to sell that product, then you can make a lot of money. 
And now the natural question is, how can we find those winning products so we can start selling them? You see, it's not quite that easy because if we would all know how to find these winning products, we would all be millionaires. But guess what? We're not. That's why you're watching this video. In my opinion, there are two main ways to find a winning product. The first is manual. The second one is automatic. Let's talk about the first one. The manual way would mean for you to go out there and look for these winning products. Search for Google keywords, look at Google trends, look what's trending on the market, do some product research by yourself, open up a store, start testing products. That's gonna take a lot of time and money. For example, check out this Google trend right here. It shows some spikes in here, right? Now, I search for the word Christmas. These spikes are the highest amount of interest that was given to that specific keyword in this specific time. Here, 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 and here. As for product research, let me give you some examples. This is one of the most well-known examples of doing product research by yourself. It does take some energy and time, but you're gonna get there. All you have to do is go to the search bar and search for TikTok made me buy it. This is one of the most popular hashtags out there. As you can see, you're gonna find a lot of products in here, a lot of videos. So your question might be right now, hey, what should I do with all these products? Now, these products are very, very trending products. This is why I told you to write this in the search bar because you're only gonna get very popular products. As you can see right here, 11 million views, 20 million views, 700,000 views, 7 million views, 200 million views, 36 million views. Now, all of these videos are promoting the product and I'm gonna show you how they are doing that. So you're gonna have to order the product by yourself. Get it to your own place, unbox the product, and start filming content by yourself. That's all you have to do. Start posting this content on TikTok and start generating traffic. Let me just give you a random example. Let's just scroll this product right here, for example. Let's check out this product. It's a, it's a basically, it looks like a lightsaber. It has 300,000 likes and it has 5 million views. Now, how did they get here? Let's click on their name. So this is their brand, Lumina Lights. Let's scroll down and you're gonna find that they have started posting the same videos over and over again multiple times. 7,000 views, 7,000 views, 13,000 views, 14,000 views. And they are trying to sell the product by showcasing it. So this is what they are doing. They are showcasing a product in very short format videos. This is 14 seconds. This is 30 seconds. This is 23 seconds. So very, very short. All you have to do is just take the product yourself and, and shoot some content with the product. This is the key right here, my friends. Do this until you're gonna get a video just like this one. This is a video that the TikTok algorithm has pushed forward because they thought that it was a great idea, right? So you're not gonna get this in the first try. You're not gonna get it in the second time. You're not gonna get this in the first try. You're not gonna get this in the second try or the third try. You're probably going to get this in the hundredth time. You just gotta be persevering and keep posting consistently every single day. Let's find another example. Let's go back at the list. For example, this one, it's a scrub gun. It has a few million views. As you can see, the comments say, everyone needs it. I want this. Russians, Italians, Spanish, English, all the languages you see here, everybody wants to buy this product. So it's pretty, pretty popular right now. Let's click on their page as well. 7,000 followers, half a million likes. Let's see, they did 3 million views and 12.3 million views and also 50,000 views. All of these are pinned because they are doing the best. So they are actually doing the same thing over and over again, but they are even more consistent because they are doing this since a long time ago. They started with 3,000, 2,000 views and they grew our way from there. They didn't give up. This is what you have to do. You don't have to give up. You have to keep repeating the same things over and over again. The difference here, the fact that I don't like about this particular page is that they did basically the same thing. They didn't do any kind of changes. They kept repeating the same thing over and over again. So just as Einstein said, madness is repeating the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. Now, these guys did it so many times that they got a video that made 12 million views. So here in their bio, you're gonna find a website, myscrubdown.com. So if you click on that, it's gonna take us to their website where they are selling this particular product. As you can see, it looks pretty good, pretty simple. You don't need more than that. And just imagine how, how much money they, they made from 12 million views once and 3 million views twice. So they have a traffic that pretty much consists of tens of thousands, maybe hundreds of thousands of people on their website. And this is just one single isolated case. There are thousands of cases just like this one of people making a lot of money with content just like this one. The whole purpose of this and the whole secret sauce from this strategy is to keep posting over and over again until at least one of your videos will become successful. That's all you need. And as opposed to this manual method, AutoDS is an automatic method, meaning that they are gonna take care of all of this process for you. Let's go to the handpicked products. 
Now, right here, they're posting daily winning products, and you're pretty much guaranteed that these products are making waves on the market because they have been found by the AutoDS team. And believe me, this is all they are doing every single day. They are looking for winning products to give you. And when it comes to product research, you don't have to do that by yourself. All you have to do is go to AutoDS and they will give you tons of winning products that are already making waves on the market. Let's check out one of their products, just a random product from this page. You're going to find a lot of useful information. You know how much you can get the product for right here. You know how much you can sell it for. What is your potential profit? The engagement score, meaning how well people are engaging for this product. What is the saturation score, meaning how many stores are selling this particular product. You're going to get a target audience example right here that you could use for your targeting. You're going to have an example of a Facebook ad right here. So somebody is using this product for a Facebook ad. And if you click TikTok, you're going to find actually two ads that other stores are using for this particular product. So you can get inspired a lot. You can learn and understand what's working and why it's working. And this is one of the best things about AutoDS, this part right here, the competitors part. It basically gives us a list of competitors that are selling this same product. So let's check out the first one. Let's click on that. It's gonna take us to a product page that's selling this particular product. And as you can see, it looks like this. It looks amazing, right? Very nice product page, very nice website. They are selling the product. You can actually learn a lot from this. And this is why I keep repeating this because I think that this is such a valuable tool that AutoDS is offering us. This is the second one. Let's click on it. It basically shows the same product, but sold in a different way. So they have another type of website. You can also learn from this because they are also providing a lot of value. Let's go to the third one. So you're going to get like four or five examples. They have also reviews in here. Their website looks more, more scarcity-ish. And this one looks a lot cleaner. I like this more. They also have the reviews here. So it's, you know, you learn a lot of things from going to AutoDS, picking a product and just looking at the competitor page. You're going to find all kinds of different stores that are selling the same product, which I think is a very, very valuable asset to have when you're doing product research. AutoDS is going to take care of the whole process for you. So you don't have to worry about anything that's fulfillment related. Right here, as you can see, they have statuses. So anytime the product is pending, ordered, shipped, delivered, or canceled, you're going to see it here. So you don't have to manually do this with every single product. Of course, you can do this manually, but you can do this with one, two, three, maybe five products a day if you're getting five orders per day. But if you're getting a lot more orders, you're going to have troubles with that. Or even if you're not going to have troubles, you're going to waste a lot of time and money and energy into doing this by yourself when you can just link your store to the AutoDS fulfillment process and they're going to take care of basically everything. The next step is doing a bit of market research. So I took all of the competitors that AutoDS gave me for this product. I checked out their websites. I saw what was working and what was not working on their websites. I learned a lot from this and I built my super store that was kind of englobing everything that I learned from these stores in one single store that had basically no mistakes. After doing this, the next thing that I needed was an ad of the product. It took me like one hour to do some research on the market. I found a lot of footage with this product being in use. I took all of that footage. I combined it in one simple ad. With a bit of editing, my ad turned out to look something like this. Now, guys, I tried selling this product on Facebook and Instagram. It just didn't work. I didn't make any sales. I mean, I made like two sales, but I spent a lot of money, so it was not profitable at all. After being very discouraged for a while, I decided to try TikTok as well. And this is where things started to go off. But wait, wait, I'm not going to show you the results yet. I want to show you the final step, which is actually importing the product to my store and working a bit on the product page. After scrolling a while on AutoDS, I decided to go with this product right here. I think it's a pretty good product. It's an evergreen product. So a lot of people will want to use this. It doesn't matter how hot it is outside. It doesn't matter if it's winter, summer. It doesn't matter if you're male or female. And that is why I decided to go with this one. Fast forward another few minutes where I use some apps to make the product page look nicer. It looks like this. Now, this is the title that I wanted to go with. Aqua Shield Clear Trademark 70% off today. Now, of course, the product is not 70% off, but it's a good way to bring customers. As you can see right here, it only has five star reviews, 12 reviews. That's a very, very good point that I want to get to later. And the price that I wanted to go with is $19.99 discounted from $60. Now, this is a psychological price, meaning that it's not quite $20. I'm losing one set in there. But a lot of people will buy only because they will be psychologically influenced of this price mark. Next up, I use Bundle Bear. This is an app that allows you to create bundles of the same product. So it's one product, two products or three products. This is a good way to incentivize your customers to buy more than one single product. 
thus increasing the AOV. AOV stands for average order value and you can increase that by making clients buy more than one single piece. And the product page looks something like this. I, it's just a title, some images, some, some very nice descriptions, some before and after images, easy application, long lasting clarity. It, it's, a, it's a pretty standard product page. I just went with the basics. I didn't want it to overcomplicate anyone. I wanted to do it as basic and as simple as possible. So basically everything that I say in here is the simplest and, and the most basic description that you can have on a product. That's exactly what I wanted. So I didn't want it to complicate the users reading this because it might scare them off and they would not buy it anymore. At the ending of my description, I just use something simple such as how to use three simple steps. Clean and dry the cracks, take the appropriate amount of glue and spread it evenly, wait 24 hours, that's it. And in the footer of the page, I use this customer review section. It's very, very important for you to have a customer review section because the visitors will see that someone else has bought the same product from your store and they will be incentivized to buy. They will gain more courage to buy the same product from you because they see that someone else has already done that. Now, the first day of the year, guys, brought me $552 in sales. By the way, let me refresh this and keep this as a lesson. Never believe anyone was not gonna refresh their dashboard. It's very important. Anyone can fake their results. If you refresh it, you cannot fake it. Now, $552 in sales from 400 online visitors. The online store conversion rate is 2.5%. That's an average for a dropshipping store. Any dropshipping store out there should aim for something like this. It's not the best, you can check out my other case studies. I had even 5%, 4, 5%, that's very good. But if it's less than 2.5%, it's not the best conversion rate. So this is kind of optimal. Next up, let's check the 2nd of February, which is $376. The 3rd of February got me $140, so on and so forth. Now the first week, in total, I did $2,000. Not too shabby. Now the problem was that my conversion rate was dropping and I tried to change my product page in different ways, but it didn't quite work. This was a sign for me that the product was maybe dying. So guys, in order for me to see if the product was working or not, I completely killed my ads. I, I only did like $20 a day and I just wanted to see if it gains any traction or not. So starting from the 9th until the 15th of January, as you can see, $0 sales, completely flat, nothing. I only had 100 visits, so my ads were off as well. But then I told myself, hey, let's give this product one last chance. Let's see how it goes. So if you look at between 16 and 23, I started getting some sales again. My highest was two, $300. And I started to see something there. My conversion rate was started growing towards 2% again. So I was getting somewhere. But before showing you my last week, I want to go back to the store and show you this area right here. This is what changed things for me. Because this app right here helped me bundle products together and I can get a higher AOV so people would spend more money. As I told you before. But this is not something that I used from the beginning. This is the actual version. So let's go back and let's select between... 24 and 31st so i did 3.5k in sales and my highest was 813 dollars and the total for the month of january was as i showed you in the beginning of the video 7266 dollars now this flat line right here this is not good of course i could have kept it at the same level maybe i could have done like ten thousand dollars with this store but i didn't because i didn't trust it this product now we're going into February and I, I know what to do now and this product will continue making me money of course because I now I know what I had to change in order for me to make more money. Now this change brought my conversion rate down a bit and as you, if you look at the conversion rate you're going to see that it's 1.78%. It's a lot less than 2.5% but still I'm profiting like 20% on this product so from 7.2k in sales my profit was around 1.5k which is not bad. Alright guys so to wrap this video up I want to tell you what are the most important things that I think got me here. Now by the way this is just one of the many case studies we're doing. I have a case study in which I showed you how to get from zero to $56,000. I actually did that with one single product in only one week. You can check out the other videos on this channel. But for this specific product, I would say that one of the biggest lessons that I learned is, first of all, nobody cares about what you personally like. I don't like this product. I didn't want to specifically sell this product. 
and I didn't quite think that it could make me $7,000 in a month. But that didn't matter because people don't really care about that. You know what people care about? Products that solve problems. And this is a product that solves a very niche specific problem. That is the logic that I went with when I decided to go with this product. Second of all, it's very important for us to work with an automation company that can automate the whole process of dropshipping. As you can see right here, I had 143 people buying this product from me. I never even once dedicated a minute into sending those products or fulfilling these orders. AutoDS took care of everything. And the last takeaway from this video is that you should not give up when you're seeing a flatline, just like I did. Instead, you should think what didn't quite work and how you can make it better so that you can fix your problem and start making more money. That was it, guys. Thank you for watching. Have an amazing day. And until next time. And we would. And we would. And we would.